Hi, I'm Merrick Wong. I'm here at, Dis at DisplayLink with... John Cummins, uh, Senior Vice President of Sales at DisplayLink. So John, I see a shelf full of DisplayLink products here. What do you got? Okay, so a quick uh, description on DisplayLink. We're a semiconductor company. We use uh, extensively Synopsys IP, uh, including USB, and that's what we'll be showing here today. Uh, we have a variety of different products. The, the, uh, the chip that we're talking about has been adopted by virtually every PC OEM and PC, OE, uh, PC accessory manufacturer uh, in the world. Uh, what we'll show here is a dock. So this is a typical one from uh, Belkin and has USB in and two videos out. So we'll show that in a second. In this case, it's a DVI and DisplayPort, Ethernet and audio. Uh, other type of products using our technology and uh, using uh, Synopsys are adapters, and these are very simple, USB in, video out, and then also uh, monitors. Uh, these are uh, portable monitors that uh, run off a of USB uh, bus power. In this case, there's a nice 15-inch uh, uh, monitor, and this packs in your bag, carry it around, and use it for your work while on the go. So when you say USB power, that means it just uses the one cable USB power. There's not a separate power brick I have That's to carry That's precisely with that. right. Okay, great, yeah. great. And of course, there's USB power delivery coming. Uh, very exciting uh, for, for these products. And these are shipping in the quantities of now, how many of you guys uh, ship? Millions of units. Millions of units. Multiple, multiple millions. Now, you've got a demonstration over here. With so a, docking, a let's talk about docking. Mm -hmm. um, so why is docking a big deal? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, BYOD has come. Uh, the days of the IT guy saying, here's your machine, here's your setup are, are long gone. People want to bring in their Macs, they want to bring in their uh, PCs, their altar books, different form factors. So. The day of the hard dock where you could chunk in and had a custom connector are long gone. The key is having a solution that works across those different OSs. And what we're showing here is a 11-inch 11, 11 MacBook Air, you know, the prototyp prototypical uh, thin uh, and light uh, notebook, you know, a little 11-inch screen with a single cable plugging into a Belkin dock and an, an adapter, a dual head adapter, we're running four 1080p screens. You'll see as you come in and take a closer look, there's absolutely no compromise in quality. So the user experience is as if you're directly connected. So I've got two 1080p movies here. Um, actually, I'm gonna grab my little trackpad here. And at the same time, we've got a couple spreadsheets uh, and Windows uh, documents. So you see that there's no latency as I move this around. It's around all the screens, you know, coming in from my home screen here and rolling this across all the way. So you're able to actually run a couple of high resolution videos, you're running the text at the same time, all of these are all, all five of these screens are being used and you're able to, able to maintain the resolution of this text so it's easy to read. And the only connector is this, it's USB 3. And this is using that Belkin docking station that you showed us That's earlier. That's correct. Okay. Correct. So uh, another thing I want to point out is uh, beyond you know very low latency, it's absolutely pixel perfect. I'm mixing uh, video and text here. Uh, folks that know about compression and codecs will know that this is difficult to do, um, having perfect text and video on the same screen. It's, it's, per, it's, it's flawless. Okay, moving off the uh, Mac environment, again, for BYOD, uh, we also obviously work on Windows as well, but also different form factors. Uh, this is a Surface Pro tablet. Uh, tablets, of course, are wonderful consumption devices, but pretty worthless as a productivity device. Uh, Again, with a simple USB 3 connection, uh, we're rolling it off to a much larger monitor here. I'm actually just showing a movie. Uh, we can show some productivity stuff here. This is a, a Dell 2340T. It's a touchscreen monitor, 23 inch. And you'll see it's really cool because I can now use this as a big Windows 8 uh, screen. Again, all being rendered off this uh, uh, Microsoft Surface uh, Pro. Uh, you can do all some interesting things here. This has got a, a webcam. And you'll see full webcam uh, capability. Again, over USB. Uh, if this was a video connector, just a video connector coming out here, I would not be able to have that coming off a single cable. Uh, but USB 3 gives us plenty of performance. This is a full 1080p webcam. You'll see the performance is fantastic. So if I, I put this at my desk, I get the touchscreen capability and I can set up my own fully ergonomic workstation to use this tablet. I can have my full size keyboard, my full size mouse, my. An Ethernet connection, audio, everything. Uh, again, off your, your tablet. And then when you're all done, just disconnect your USB and you walk away with your tablet. And then I have another setup at home with another DisplayLink product at home. Correct. So, John, thanks for showing us a demo. We got the Windows platform, the MacBook, this, you know, really demonstrating that bring your own device capability, one docking station, multiple devices. Um, so, why did DisplayLink choose Synopsys as an IP provider? So, this is a very difficult application. Uh, it's running video, Ethernet, audio and full data over USB 3. We've shown four 1080p's. We can run up to six, no problem. 
Uh, so we needed the best IP we could find, and uh, it's been proven in the marketplace. This product's a big success. All the PC OEMs use it. Uh, so it's been a great working relationship, and uh, it's been great IP from Synopsys. Thanks for saying so. Um, we certainly wish display like many millions more in shipments. Excellent. Th Thanks, thanks for having us here at, right. at DisplayLink.